While the enclosure of the digital commons isn't conducted at gunpoint, merely at point of a tedious TOS, the logic of permission remains. It's so naturalized that private entities do and in fact ought to own profit-making resources and all of their output that it simply seems forgone that usage data, location, communication, history, mood, ought to also belong to them. Putting private enclosures into relief with a theoretical non-private enclosure gives the thought clarity. So I asked Evan what she thought a truly disintermediated system would look like, one that was fair to artists and people that wanted to support them. I mentioned Bandcamp. Bandcamp has been purchased by Epic Games, but I think we agreed that Bandcamp was at best a transient solution to what is ultimately a fundamental problem. Yeah, I mean, you know, shout out to Bandcamp, I think. You know, those folks are great and and the service that they're providing for artists is, like you said, I, I think, you know, kind of one of the best out there right now. Mm -hmm. In terms of where we go, I mean, I think the technology already exists to have a Spotify that's entirely owned by musicians. Mm -hmm. um, and, you know, the problem has been adoption. Um, and also, again, the problem is that our current copyright laws make it really, really hard to spin something like that up, you know, just because of the complexity of doing it um, and not getting your own music taken down but because of the way that the system works now. Um, but I do think that there really genuinely are, you know, opportunities to create decentralized alternatives to platforms like Spotify or Apple Music where you know as that could essentially run as a nonprofit, where you know all of the revenue goes back to artists minus you know whatever the transparent cost of running the platform is um, and i think that that is within reach and really all we have to do or, or what we have to do is fight for policies that both protect that ability for software developers and artists and creators to come together to solve those problems um, and also to create a level playing field so that something like that could get off the ground and compete with something like Spotify without getting crushed by overzealous copyright enforcement um, or kind of other ineffective policies that primarily benefit the biggest players.